camera there and the laptop. You go through what's in my day bag, so I'm gonna do that today. Hey guys and welcome to this vlog. Today I'm going to be doing like a daily vlog. I've got a few things on today. I'm going to head to the gym and I'm also flying later today. And before my flight, I want to share with you what I bring with me in my bags and stuff. So if you're interested in that type of content, make sure you keep watching. <laughs> but yeah, as I said, I'm going to head to the gym. I just woke up and it's like 9.30 <laughs> and I just had like the best sleep of my life. I like slept for 10 hours. I don't know if you guys like this too, but the past five days I haven't gotten enough enough sleep and so it's like slowly crept up on me and yeah i just needed like a good sleep last night so glad i did that i'm in my gym gear already but i'm gonna actually have a pre-workout first and i've been having this pre-workout the past week by naked harvest and i'm obsessed with it this is the sweet strawberry flavor and it literally just tastes like a pink lemonade <laughs> It's like really good. And what I like about this product is it uses all natural ingredients. So it's got like magnesium in it. It's got creatine, vitamin C. It's got raspberry ketones, which helps to break down fat cells and stuff. And it also has leturine. I don't know how to pronounce these things, but that's good to decrease fatigue and stuff like that, which I am needing. But yeah, I'm gonna make this now and then I'm gonna head to the gym. I'm gonna take you guys with me. So I hope you enjoy this video. It's Brayden hacking Bree's vlogging camera. So I'm about to make a protein shake for myself and I thought I'd make one for Brie as well, but I know that she would want to film that for her vlog. So instead of her doing that, I'm going to film for her so she can include this in the vlog. Let's go. Cool. So we got some protein powder. I got two different types of protein powders. One's the whey protein and the other one's the vegan one or something. Um, so best of both worlds and banana and some collagen powder and some milk. So let's go. So I just found out Brayden made me a protein shake, which is really lovely. Um, apparently he said he vlogged it, so <laughs> I'm excited to watch the footage. Thanks, babe. <laughs> yeah, I love it, babe. Thanks. I'm actually, um, I'm actually running a bit late, so this is great. <laughs> So I need to leave really quickly, but, but I had a comment from one of you guys asking to go through what's in my day bag. So I'm going to do that today. This is the day bag that I take. It's just our company day bag that we have to, to wear. So basically there's two compartments. There's a top compartment and a bottom compartment. To be honest, this is like literally what I take every day. I don't even know what's in here because um, I flew last week. So <laughs> let's find out together, shall we? Okay. so. In the top compartment, I have, of course, Paw Paw. If you're from Australia, you know how great these are. It's great to always have them. Um, they're also good for burns, chafing, cracked skin, gravel rash, everything you need. So if you're in a layover and you hurt yourself, this is like a good little ointment to have with you. Not only is it good for those things, but I always wear it on my lips and it keeps my lips really hydrated. And there's that one. AirPods in case my operating sector turns out into a packing sector. It's always good to be prepared. <laughs> and then I have some hand sanitizer, obviously, because the current climate that we live in. Spare masks. These are our company masks. So just have that. Some hand cream. This is running out, but great to have hand cream. Oh, I've got this little tin here. It's 
it's got prepared for anything and i got it from um bras and things it has like everything you need like hair ties it's got lip balm it's got a little sewing kit so i would definitely recommend picking one of these up just to have in your bag some pens because we always have to have a pen on us a lip liner i don't know what that's doing in there <laughs> um i've got a torch we have to have a torch to do our checks in the oven to make sure there's nothing in the oven got just my wallet um i've got this cream because i get dermatitis on my hands when i fly a lot and this cream is was like a life center for me so that helps fantastically another hand cream random mask i have random earrings if i have a layover or something and i want to change from pearls because we can't wear hoops fun fact <laughs> my phone obviously and of course i've got a lip stick when and hopefully when we don't have to wear masks anymore, I've got lipstick for that, so. Okay, so in the bottom compartment, I have this. This is for your ears. If there's a standoff bay and you have to walk to the aircraft, it's always good to wear them because then it doesn't damage your ears because the aircraft is really loud, especially the, the engine. Um, pads. I have a little pouch for all my Invisalign stuff. So I have like a toothbrush and mouthwash and stuff this is great not only for invisalign but also if i have an unexpected layover then i know i've got a toothbrush and some toothpaste to brush my teeth <laughs> i have my asic which is my identification card that usually goes on my jacket cardigan because it gets really cold on the aircraft so it's good to have a cardigan and this is our company cardigan as well got a high vis vest we have to wear this um, whenever we're on the ground outside the aircraft if you don't you can get fined <laughs> so you have to wear this obviously so that aircrafts and trucks and things can see you on the tarmac because you don't want to get hit by anything so i have my apron this is what i use for service we have to wear an apron when we're doing service so i've got that another mask because we have masks everywhere these days another ball ball because i don't know i've got this frizz ease tube I bring this um, to fix my flyaways and it's basically a finishing cream and because when you go through security you have to take out all your aerosols I hate taking out all my aerosols so I bring this because it's not an aerosol and it works great um, makes your hair not as crusty which is good there's like a little side pocket for a bunch of teas if I want to have a tea on the aircraft what else do I have I have these little like sanitizers they're like single use sanitizers oh $50, great. <laughs> Love that. <laughs> oh my gosh. And then I've also got these little oat things. I always have these in my bag because oats fill you up really easy and they're really easy to make on the aircraft as well. So if I'm hungry or something, then I've got that as like a little spare. Oh, and I'm, I'm bringing this today as a little snack. I'll eat probably the crew food what's on the aircraft today because we get given food. So yeah, that is all what's in my bag. I hope you enjoyed that. That was a bit of a surprise for me. I'm grateful I found $50, that's great. <laughs> Something that I almost forgot to take is my cabin flats. So we can wear flat shoes on the aircraft. And we have to wear heels outside in the terminals and during boarding and stuff. But yeah, it's always good to bring flats because sometimes after a long day, your feet get a bit sore. So oh yeah, that is all what's in my bag. I hope you enjoyed this. Now let's head to work. So I've already been to work and back. I apologize that I didn't really get to speak to you guys much at work or tell you anything about work. I was in a bit of a rush this morning and didn't have the time to do it, but yeah, I just wanted to say I'm home. Today we flew two flights. I flew to Ballina and then back home to Melbourne. So it was just a day trip, just a short little day. We started at 12.30 and it's currently 7 p.m. The flights were super packed. Everyone seems to be going to Ballina. We had a few celebrities on board as well, which was cool. 
It's super bright today, isn't it? So I'm back home. I've just gotten into some comfy clothes. <laughs> but yeah, I want to show you our Christmas tree because we recently put it up and it was from Coles, believe it or not. <laughs> um, and it's really cute. So this is our Christmas tree. But yeah, it's just in our front room because we haven't got anything yet for this room. <laughs> Braden and I are having a meeting with a couple that were filming their wedding and Braden set up the camera so that the visuals are really good on FaceTime. This is just FaceTime, but he's set up our good camera as the camera for the FaceTime, which is really cool. I'll show you what it looks like in his room. Okay, so this is the setup. It's got the camera there and the laptop <laughs> and then Braden. <laughs> okay, it looks so good, hey. Yeah, it's pretty cool, hey. When we do sales calls or whatever, yeah. not sales calls, but you know what I mean. Anyways, just thought I will document that. <laughs> I feel like, oh, I'm naked. Yeah. <laughs> Why are we going to shirt off? We just got off the call with the couple that were filming their wedding. Braden is cooking the chicken right now. I won't film you because This is our dinner, obviously they're wraps. <laughs> but yeah, tonight's gonna be a pretty chill night. We've just gotta tidy up the house a bit because I'm doing a shoot here actually tomorrow for a swimwear company that is just about to launch. So I'm doing some video for them. So I'm gonna end this vlog now. I hope you enjoyed this day with me. Thank you for coming along the ride and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. Oh, I look so good, don't I? Prisoner <laughs> And basically what's in it is like... <laughs> <laughs>